The impact of the interest rates is starting to be felt. This is Steve Myers with Urban Cool Homes and we just got the data for the October home sales and it's really starting to show a slight impact of the interest rates. Now when it comes to the home sold, it's basically flat, just a slight increase from last year. But what we're really starting to see the impact is the average price and the median price. So both of those dropped about 7% year over year. But really what that's telling us is that this the high end of the market's really starting to slowly disappear. Um, people aren't willing to spend as much when the interest rates are so high. So home prices are still kind of basically still in line with where they were at, just less higher end homes are being sold. So, so that's obviously still a really good sign. So if we're kind of in the median or below the median price, like we're still in a really good spot to sell. So the days on market is 10 days compared to six days year over year compared to October of 2022. So what we're seeing is that houses are sitting a little bit longer. The impact probably due is, is due to interest rates. However, we are starting to get back into that normal, more normal market post COVID. So it could be the seasonality kind of creeping in there as well. So, you know, as a whole, these numbers really are just kind of showing us there is a slight impact on the interest rates, but also we are kind of going into a normal market. Now inventory is still two, two months on market. So basically there's enough market, enough homes on the market to sell for two months which is still well below the six months that we would see on a kind of a standard of a seller's market to a buyer's market. So we're still in a very hot seller's market in terms of the way the inventory is lined out. So we still need more inventory. So it's still a really good time to get your market on the, to sell. Um, but we are seeing the inventory slowly creeping up as last, last year was 1.2 months, now we're at two months. So, you know, we'll, we'll probably see that continue to tick up as we go through the rest of the winter. But however, I imagine that once spring comes, we'll start seeing that inventory number decrease. So, so again, really good time to still list your house, especially when you're in the, you know, probably 300K less range. Um, we're still seeing those houses go quickly. When you're in a 300K and above, houses could sell a little bit longer, but we are still seeing the, the really nicer homes still selling at a, at a high rate. So um, those are the numbers for October. Um, if you have any questions, let us know.